guys, it is Andrea, and today I'm doing my plan with me for August, which is crazy, 7th to the 13th, and this is going up a day later than normal, and that is because I made an oops, which we'll go into, which has to do with this lovely note that Jessica left for me on this as if kit. Jessica actually forgot a sheet of stickers at work from a kit that she was using, and I forgot my whole dang kit at work, and I didn't realize till Sunday night at 8.30 after I had already scrubbed off all of my glitter nail polish and was ready to go, I forgot my kit at work. So, that is the sitch on that one. I am going to be using the As If kit, which this was the uh, pre-party kit. Uh, the pre-party kit was not like exclusive to the pre-party or anything, it was just themed at, to Clueless, which was the movie that we saw at the pre-party. But the party kit, the one that um, Jessica drew, which was this week's kit, was exclusive to the party. So this is what comes in the kit. I'll just kind of flip through it really quick. Super cute. Um, I love this so, so, so much. I love the pinks. Super excited to use it. We'll go obviously more into it as I put everything down. It does have some options whenever it comes to the shop on Friday, so it will have the option for the tall boxes, but I'm not going to use these this week. The fit sheet, which I mentioned that this is like the last fit sheet. No other kits will have fit sheets from now on. This just was already printed and cut, so I figured I'd put them up. The glitter headers, which I'm actually going to use the glitter headers from Best Witches, just because I think the black will look really cool with all of the pinks and stuff, but there is this as well. And then also the personal kit, which those will all be in the shop, along with the ultimate on Friday. So I am really excited to use this. And again, I'm just using the all black glitter headers because I think it's going to look cool. And then I am using some stuff from Summer Multicolor. And Summer Multicolor, this is the last weekend if you want to pick up anything to pick it up because next week is Fall Multicolor. So I brought out the movie marquee. Actually, I actually don't think I'll need this. No. Because we're only going to see one movie and I have a movie marquee in the thing. So I don't actually need that at all. So I brought out my film edit upload stickers. So I have four sheets of those in the summer multicolor line. And then I brought out date dots, which are also in the shop. And then I brought out the pregnant Andreas, which I'm so excited. I'm using up that sheet soon. And then I did order, and I was gonna save this for a haul, but I'll just mention it in this video. I did order a bunch of daisies. And I didn't even, the way that they were set up on the listing, daisies like underneath the rest of them. And I didn't even notice that she has a white outfit, which I think is so cute. She has like a little bit tanner of skin, but like, I really don't care. I just like that the outfit's white and I think that's really cool because it'll match everything. It's like neutral and she even wrote that on the card is Daisy's neutral life. And I was like, I didn't even notice or I would have probably just bought Daisy from the beginning because I love like the white outfit. I think that's adorable. So I brought out these four sheets to um, use. I brought out, let me see you guys in a bit more. Ooh, it's a little bit too much. I brought out like the working laptop ones. The birthday ones, the partying ones, though I probably will just use the birthday ones. And then I brought all, also brought out the pool day ones, or like the summer ones. And then I also picked up all of them, pretty much. All of them that applied, so I got the New Year's Eve ones, the winter ones, the winter bucket list, the like sad ones, the bathtub ones with the rubber ducky, the fast food ones, happy mail, the little like me time. New Year's Eve, summer bucket list, the little emoji, emotion icon type things, travel, laundry, sleepy, pajama girl, and then the new formatted take my money, and also the like, ugh, nope, no thanks kind of girl. So I bought all of these and I'm like so happy. I didn't even know she existed, but now that I know she exists, my life has changed and those are from Foxy Cactus and obviously I will link Foxy Cactus down below, but I'm sure y'all know fox and cactuses because i think i use them almost every week so let's go ahead and get into the plan with me okay i don't know what happened to that clip but just put down this box and i'm starting on here so i was just talking about how awesome the planner party went i just i don't know i was just really happy with the way that everything went i'm very hard on myself as far as expectations go for things and I really wanted the party to be as amazing as possible. I, yeah, mm, eh, no, I don't want to put the pink there. I'm going to put the black. I know it's going to be too pink in a row. We're going to do that. Okay. So, I'm sorry. I'm losing it. So, last week was super stressful, like, in the beginning because I wanted to make sure everything was perfect. And then I feel like after the pre-party, I started to mellow out a little bit because I was like, everything has been prepared. You got this. Trying to, like cheerlead myself a little 
and I just think that everything went really smoothly. I feel like time like flew, which was crazy. I'm pretty sure that this year's party was an hour longer than last year's, I think, maybe. And it just went so fast. I met so many people and I just feel like this year I've got to connect with more people. I feel like last year for some reason, I don't know if it was because I was mostly like working merch, but I feel like I didn't get enough time with everyone but I feel like this year I got to talk to so many people and like hear their stories and things like that which was really really fun and I got to take a lot more pictures with people and I don't know it was just awesome I got to meet a lot of planner girls I got to meet a lot of new shop owners and overall it was just so fun and I'm just I just am like thankful do you know what I mean like it's just it's been an honor it's been an honor to serve and I, and the food was so good, guys. I mean, I talked about the food the whole entire time. But I will have a video up, I believe, on Thursday of the swag unboxing and giveaway type stuff. So that was all of the swag that everyone got this year. And it was just so fun. I could probably go on all day about it. But I'm just really excited and I'm happy that it went well and everyone was happy. And yeah, and I'm just really, really thankful. So... That was my weekend. We had the pre-party on Friday. Saturday was the planner party. I, uh, I'll talk more about like everything that went down as far as like my schedule goes, like what we did um, on my rewind spread, but it was like, it was intense guys. At the end of the setup, I had like five minutes to do my makeup and somehow my makeup like looked decent and lasted the whole entire night so i was very impressed with that um but yeah there was a couple little crisis but we got it under control um as far as like we were down like some linens but jessica was there thankfully and she was able to go pick up some and just some other random little things we ran out of seats which i really don't know how that happened but ran out of seats somehow but we got that under lock too um, but it was all just a very, like, it was very, it was really just good. Like, I'm just really happy with the way that it turned out. And I, I don't know, I couldn't have asked for a better, a better experience. And I thank all of you guys who came and all of the sponsors and everyone who contributed to the bags and all of the, um, all of the squad and then the, um, like the vet, the vendors, the, not the vendors, the, what are they called? Like the caterer and the photo booth guy and the venue themselves. What are those called? Are they vendors? I think so. But yeah, it's just been, what? Oh, my, my niece just sent me a text and I don't have her phone number saved in my phone because she just got a new phone saying video of me jumping off the bridge. And I was like, what? Because I didn't recognize the number and I was like, okay, cause she's in, um, Tennessee right now and I told her to send me a video of her jumping off of a bridge because she's been bridge jumping and I thought that was really cool so and I haven't jumped off a bridge in like years probably since I was like 12 13 maybe no maybe 14 well, I used to jump off trestles to like like train thing I don't know but any which way so let's go ahead and put in the little things I think I'm gonna color my little things so I'm gonna go ahead and put in all of these guys first so yeah, there was that on Saturday. And then on Sunday, I had like really big like ambitions. Like we planned to do like Amanda's like birthday bash that day, which was gonna be pretty much uh, chilling by the pool and then going out to eat. But I was honestly dead. I woke up, I couldn't fall asleep like at all. I I, I don't know if it, I, I think I was just in like a lot of pain on Saturday night, a lot more than I was used to. Not that like it was unbearable, but it was just like really uncomfortable and I couldn't fall asleep till like past 1.30, which is wild for me. Normally I fall asleep really fast and I woke up in a lot of pain. I was like crying because I had really bad leg cramps and then my whole body just still, it's Monday evening and my body is still like hurting really, really bad. But I think I'm gonna go for a prenatal massage this week, hopefully. I haven't called to schedule anything yet, but I think I need to go um, because it was the first time I actually took Tylenol as well, I think, this whole pregnancy, but I, I'm in a lot of pain right now as far as my muscles go, and I think it's just from starting at 10 o'clock on Saturday and then 
just going straight through till about like 10 ish on Saturday as well. So I think that that is what what really bit me in the butt and I feel like I didn't take enough breaks, which I probably should have. So for next time that I'm pregnant and throwing a party, I need to take a couple more breaks, but I will live and you want to do? Yeah. I will live and I just need to get like a massage or something, maybe like an icy hot patch or something. I don't know, but like my legs hurt really bad. Um, as far as my calves and then my shoulders hurt really bad as well. But I didn't wake up with leg cramps this morning, so I'm pretty happy. All is well in my universe. So I just put in Bachelorette and then some packages that I'm getting. And putting in these glitter headers. Normally I do this day by day, but I'm just figuring that it might be a little bit easier because sometimes I like start to forget the glitter headers and then it's like a hot mess and we don't need that this week. I'm already all over the place. I really can't believe it was so funny because Jessica like texted and was like, yeah, I forgot the little things at, at work. Um, I forgot to put one in because she like assembled her own kit to take home and she was like, yeah, I don't know what happened. And I was like, hey, Jessica, you so silly. <laughs> and then I sat down. I like, I like waited till the last minute and procrastinated all night to film. And then I had like chipped nail polish on and I was like, that's not going to fly on my plane with me. So I came in here and I scrubbed off my nail polish for like 15 minutes. And then I ran back and forth between here and the bedroom, like getting my memory card and getting this and getting that and getting my planner and my other thing. And, da -da -da -da. and then I sat down and I opened this, not this one. Not this one. I opened this. The doorbell just rang. I opened this and I saw there's a post-it note and I was like, I didn't even bring home the kit. And I had them at my house three times because I took them to the pre-party and brought them home from the blood party and then took them to work. And like they were here before. And I was like, Andrea, like how in the world do you do the things that you do? I don't even know. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the sidebar real quick. I'm gonna put in two habit trackers. I'm not sure what I'm gonna put in there yet because I've been failing on my habit trackers hardcore, but I'm just gonna put them in for now and kind of hope for the best. I ordered some Lush stuff today and I really wish it was here, but I don't think it is, which is sad, but I don't know what just got delivered, but it's, I don't think it's the Lush stuff because I just checked the tracking, but I'm like real low on bath supplies right now and I could use a nice, nice warm bath. But what was I saying? So yeah, I was making fun of Jessica and Karma bites you in the butt just bites you and then I was like are you kidding me and then I just sat here and stared at my planner and I was like do I want to change the spread that I'm doing not really um I'm gonna leave this actually I lied no I'll put the to do in so let's do I have an extra heart checklist over here which is black perfect and then I'm going to do a to do and I'll do the to do in the light pink I feel like I have to burp, which is just great. I had like an intense craving for spaghetti today. So I went and bought like all the ingredients for spaghetti, but I had to take like a Zantax, Zantac beforehand and then Tums like directly after because it's like a real, real not fun time when I eat anything with pasta sauce. I just like slowly die inside. So there's that, but I'm really, really in the mood for some pasta, so it's gonna happen. Let's go ahead and start day by day. So first, I'm gonna put in my YouTube things. I'm actually gonna put my YouTube all in because I'm doing five videos this week, and I think I might just be doing five videos until like I burn out because I have a lot of videos I wanna put up, so it's gonna happen. So I think I wanna use what colors match pretty well. I'm not going to like try and color block these. I'm going to kind of try and not color block these actually. So I'm going to put the purple one here. This is like a muted purple. It doesn't match that one at all, but that's okay. I'm going to take the muted purple again and put that over on Friday. I have a desk tour pre-filmed and pre-uploaded. I think that's going to go up next week, so definitely keep an eye out for that. I'm going to do the light pink. Which that light pink does not even like match clothes. I'm gonna say this one probably matches. Actually, I'll put the light pink here. Yeah, I'll do the light pink. I don't really care. It's fine. It's not my favorite, but it's not my least favorite option. 
So that's okay. I should have brought the, the fall multicolor one because it has a black on it. And black would match pretty well. And then I'm going to do a pink to match this pink. I think I'll do... It's kind of in the middle of these two. So I think I'm going to do the like brighter one. Because it just gives a little bit more contrast to this light pink one. Yeah, that doesn't match perfectly, but you know, like I said, these stickers are sisters, not twins. That's was well, not what I just said, but that's what I'm saying now. I don't know, this color actually is really bothering me. I think it's just too berry y. Maybe I'll try this one. Yeah, I guess that one matches better, and it's still kind of a contrast from the pink. I just contradict myself constantly, so I'm done with these. Perfect. And then. I guess I'll put in work, actually. I don't even know what I'm doing this week, guys. So I went to work today. It was kind of a joke going to work today because I didn't really do anything. There was a lot of, like, jumping for balloons and putting away stuff from the planner party. And I'm going to go to work on Thursday as well. And then I think I'm also going to go to work on Wednesday. Just because, like I said, I didn't get a lot done today at all. So I think that I need to go back in. I was going to spend Wednesday designing Christmas stuff, but I think Christmas stuff can wait until next week. And then I'm going to put my weekend banner before I forget that. This is a real, a real plan with me, guys. We're all over the place, but we're getting it done. Weekend banner. Now let's go day by day. Oh, wait. Did I not get groceries with these? I might have to place an order. I didn't get groceries today anyways, so it doesn't really matter, but... Somebody needs to remind me, I need to buy grocery stickers from Fox and Cactus. Now, where did all my stickers go? I was using over here. So let's go ahead and get into this. So on Monday, I have my YouTube sticker in. I went to work. Today, I need to do payroll, which will go on top. And then other than that, the bachelorette's on. So, other, so all I'm going to do here is put in, that's not full boxes. I'm going to put in a full box. So I think I'm going to do the Beverly Hills full box in here. And I think I'm going to put in... It's just a little short. Hmm. I think I'm going to put in some water. Okay. I'm going to do some washi in here. So let's go ahead and put in the thicker pieces of washi underneath all of the work labels just to bring those up a little bit. I do have a lot going on this week, but like a lot of it's like checkbox stuff. A lot of it is, guys. And I'm going to put this in here. I'm actually going to layer this over just so I don't know. I'm going to do it all at the top. It's okay. I'm going to put this down first and see kind of what it looks like. So I don't have anything going on today. I went to lunch with Nick. But I don't think I need to put that in there. So I'm going to just stick this on here like so. And then I'm going to get out one of my Fox and Cactus girls and put her in for work. Like that. And then on Tuesday, I should probably do this for all of them. I'm going to go ahead and do this for all of them before I forget for work. Just grab another piece of the second thickness of washi. Stick that in there. Stick this in. should probably actually wait and see if I want to put anything in there. So let's, let's just stop. Okay, so on Tuesday, I have YouTube. I want to call and make a nail appointment. I need to do stuff for, for Brie. I need to place an order. Design November. I don't know what that last thing. Oh, I have a package coming in. <sighs> oh, okay, so it's Amanda's birthday. So I brought out these birthday stickers here. And then also we're doing Amanda's birthday dinner, which can kind of all go together. So I think for this one, I'm going to grab a full box and I'm going to use the um, date. No, I'm going to use the like notebook paper one and put it on the bottom. This is like a mostly a chest checklist day. I'm gonna grab a piece of washi. I'm gonna do this like daisier one up here. Daisier. Daisy one up top. And then I'm gonna grab a half box. I'm gonna do one of the ones with the notebook paper because I think that's adorable. Up top here. And then I'm just gonna put in one of these birthday girls. Do I wanna put in one for dinner and one for this? Maybe. It's a little crooked. I'm going to leave it. 
So I think I'm going to do one of these girls with the little like princess hat on for Amanda's birthday. And then for dinner, I'm going to do one of the, this little like appointment label. And I'll just stick it. Because I have so much checklist stuff. Maybe I'll do a flag because I'm not using flags for work right now. So I think I'm going to do that. That'd be cute. Let's grab a flag. Going to do a hot pink flag like this. And then maybe a little cake. Do I want to do a cake or do I want to do the Celebrate Munchkin for Amanda's birthday whenever we go out to eat? I think we're going probably for tacos of some sort. And then on the 9th is work and then also a bunch of stuff for my checklist. So I'm just gonna put in a full box. I think another full box that I don't wanna cover up is this computer, because I just think it's so cute. And I actually left the perfect amount of space in here. Perfect, so I'm gonna go ahead, give my camera a break to cool down, and I'll be right back. Okay, so on Thursday, we have YouTube in, and then I also have a doctor's appointment, which is weird, because Nick and I had in our um, let me see, I'm going to use just the little daisy sticker. Nick and I had in our schedules, both of ours, that we had a doctor's appointment next week. We were both like super confused because that wouldn't like add up for two weeks. But, um, we got like an email saying we have an appointment this week and I was like, oh cool. I like having doctor's appointments as long as they're not sticking me and that was last week. So they're not sticking me this week, thank goodness. So I'm just going to go ahead and put in this full box here. And then for the doctor's appointment, I'm going to put in an appointment label. And I'm going to use the black one just because it's pretty. And we'll stick that in there. And then I'm just going to grab the little stethoscope on here, which is super cute because it's pink. Stick that right on there. And then on Friday is payday. So for payday, I'm just going to put the little payday sticker up on the first heart like I normally do and then grab the little money stack and put that next to it as per usual. And then I'm gonna also put down the plan next week sticker just so I don't forget on Sunday. Put that up a little higher. And what else was on Friday? Friday is a pool day with Amanda. So I'm gonna take this little pool sticker, which I'm really excited. Nick and I are going over to hang out with her and her fiance. I forgot to put in the little girls for Fox and Cactus for the working. I feel like I all of a sudden lost all my energy. I feel like it's getting a little toasty in here. So I got those in. So what did I want to do on Friday? I'm just going to put in another full box, I think. A lot of full boxes this week. If anything else comes up, I put a half box over it and call it a day. Another piece of washi. You can use the one that matches. Perfect. And then I'm just going to use a half box. I think this one I'm going to use another one of the lined ones just because I think these are so cute. And I'm going to put the little girl on her little unicorn floaty down here. Which I'm really excited for the pole day. And then on Saturday and Sunday, I'm going to use the final two boxes, which is kind of like a little like two box scene kind of deal up top. Like this. And then on Saturday is 32 weeks pregnant. So I'm gonna put that in up top, I think, cause I don't think I have as many checklists. I'm just going to stick that here and I'm going to put in the little Andrea pregnant stickers. I didn't even need the date covers. So I'm going to go ahead and put those away. And then also on Saturday is Nick and I's 10 and a half years, which sounds kind of corny, but I think it's cute. I don't like mark every month, but I think like the year and then the half year is cute. So I'm going to put a little appointment. Do I have Yeah. Um, yeah, I'll do the little appointment label on the bottom. For that, I actually want to grab out my, whoops, 
my Fox and Cactus stickers. Because I have the little custom couple ones, which I think would be really, really cute. And there. But above that, I am also going to help Jessica move. Well, Nick and I are going to help Jessica move. So I'm going to put that in with a little piece of... Actually, I'm going to do a black half box with a little piece of pattern washi underneath it. But I'm really excited because she's letting me help her set. Well, it's pretty much like what I'm helping. I'm not going to help her move as in move things. Um, but I'm going to help her organize and like set up her planner area, which I'm really excited for. So I'm going to put that in. And then I don't really have like a moving sticker, I don't think. Um... So I might just leave this. Oh, I should put I should put in a fox and cactus mermaid. Duh, it's Jessica. So for this one, I don't have like a pink based one, but I think the one with the orange and pink hair will be fine. I'm just gonna use like a small one. Or no, I'll use this one because it has like the pink and the purple, like right here, helping Jessica move. I'm gonna put the little couple sticker down here. So cute. And then on Sunday, um, I think, oh wait, I'm not going to the movies. We were going to go see a movie this weekend, but it's not out yet. So I think just, oh, why did I have a movie sticker? I don't know. I think we're, oh, that, yeah, it was like a whole debate. So we're going to go to the movies because there's a movie. We want to go see um, Ingrid Goes West, but it doesn't come out this weekend. But they're playing it on Tuesday at the Alamo, so I think there's like an early release thing. So we're going to brunch on Sunday. So I think for that, I'm going to use a half box. I think, I think, I think, I think. Yeah. Or do I wanna use like a colored one? No, I'm gonna use this one. And then I'll put a piece of solid washi in between. I'm gonna use the purple solid washi. So me, Amanda, and Jessica are going to go to brunch in the morning because we were going to go to the movies, but that did not work out. So I think for this, I'm going, I want to use the Celebrate Munch again. I think I'm going to use what I have here. Oh, I can use the little sparkly dress girl. Where are you? Are we all just, no, I need use sparkly dress girl. Where are you, boo? Oh, here she is. So I'm going to do the little one with like the champagne while pretend it's a mimosa, though I can't drink and I don't drink either way, but I think that's really, really cute. So that is everything for this spread, I think. Let's go ahead and kind of look at it from afar. I feel like I have a lot written down, but it doesn't like translate into here. So I'm going to go ahead and, oh, I have to do the sidebar. What am I thinking? I feel like I'm still very scatterbrained and I'm sure you guys can tell. So I'm gonna go ahead and put this in. I feel like I should, I feel like I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, we'll just put this, I don't know. The struggle's real. Let's actually put in another checklist. Let's do the, to clean, do I to clean? Yes. So I'm gonna put in a little to clean sticker. I need to wash it obviously. Obviously, we need some washi. The to clean sticker. And then a purple three heart checklist. And then I'm gonna put in another, this, this full box here. And then I'm just gonna trim off the excess. And then I'm gonna put in just a quarter box for my little like weekly overview type deal. Right in the middle. Just to put like something in there at the end. So I'm gonna go ahead and fill everything out and then I will come back for the deco. But I think this actually turned out really, really cute and I could have picked a better week to use it. So um, I'll be right back. Okay, so I have everything filled out and I'm honestly in love. Like in love, in love, in love. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in some of the deco, which I love this Jeep. I think it is so cute. And I've been doing the deco like smaller recently and I've been doing kind of like the double deco kind of look where it's like double of the same deco. 
and I've been liking it. I feel like it's hard to do like just one set of deco because then the deco would be huge and then it's kind of like harder to place places. So I hope that you guys have been kind of enjoying this size deco because I mean, I really have. I just think that it's perfect if you wanna, you know, put some of the smaller stuff up top and some of the bigger stuff out on the bottom. So I still try and keep things kind of like, ooh, he's kicking me. Um, kind of, um, I'm losing my train of thought. So some of the stuff I still try to keep a little bit bigger just so that if you wanna kind of decorate the bottom, you still can and it won't look like super itty bitty little stuff. But if you wanna still do kind of like deco along the top, it still looks super, what else did I put down here? Super cute as well. So I try to take a lot into consideration, especially when like sizing things for the kits, just because I wanna make sure that they, you know, can still be functional for the way that they're intended to, but still be functional in other ways as well. So I hope that you guys enjoy that. And I think even if you only wanna use one set of the deco, a lot of deco can be used for other things. Like I would totally use these little like eyelash curlers for marking like makeup kind of things and the little lipsticks, same kind of deal. And the little hair brushes, the pens for planning. Oh, I did wanna put plan next weekend. That's two pens in a row. Let's put the other pen down here. Um, but yeah, so there's that. And I'm really excited for this week's new releases. Again, this is the last week, um, like this weekend included, to pick up any of the summer multicolors if you wanna stock up on that. Even these phones, like to call, like I'm gonna put that little, no, because there's a phone up there, but that'd be so cute to put like over the heart. I'm gonna do it, I don't care. I'm gonna do it. And this computer is so cute. So, whew. and then I'm gonna put in the Scroll Prince Co. new releases. This week we're releasing this kit, which is As If, and then we're also going to be releasing Best Witches, which I'll show you, I'll show you. Best Witches, which is really cute. A very cute Halloween kit with a like Halloween half box, which I love. And then we also have these, which are gonna be on, kind of like a pre-order on um, more SPC, which I'll have more information on this on Wednesday. So you have an ultimate kit with spooky cakes and that's going to have the glitter headers in there and then also the post-it notes. These will not come in any other format. It'll just be, this is an item for $30. So you're gonna have the ultimate kit, the glitter headers and the post-it note, which is a really good deal um, because usually it's just like the ultimate kit alone for $30. So ultimate kit, the glitter headers and the post-it note. And this is like a grid post-it note. And then you also have Boo, which has the ultimate kit, the glitter headers, and then also a weekly post-it note. And then also there is gonna be the option. I was just gonna do Halloween ones, but I thought add in a fall one too, so you have a lot of options. So you're not just gonna have two kits and you know, for the shipping, there's three kits. Um, so there's, this is Kirsten and Brian's wedding kit, so it's forever and always, and it, it's a really nice fall kit and super cute. Not super wedding-y, it doesn't have to be very wedding-y. And this has the ultimate kit, the glitter headers, and then also the post-it notes. And these are all in the new format, so they're gonna be completely different than they were before. Boo only came in a mini kit last year, so this is going to be really fun to show you guys these on Wednesday as well. So um, this kit and Best Witches have all of the um, options, so I'll go over those on Wednesday. So I think that's everything. I'll go ahead and show you guys what's left here, but I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love, I'm in love. So I don't have any of the ombre heart checklist or full boxes left. I used the black glitter headers again. These are not the as if glitter headers, they are the best witches um, glitter headers, but I think that the black looks really cool. But if you were, if you wanted to do the pink, I think it would look equally as cool, especially with the, with the purple in there. And you do have the option for the black anyways. And then you have this sheet, you have your little things, the functional sheet. I feel like I use a lot more of the functional sheet during the week when I'm planning. And then you have your washi and headers, your sampler, date strip, which I did not use this week. I haven't used a date strip. Oh, I used one last week. I can't say that. And then you also have the front page here. So super cute. I love this kit. I think it turned out really, really cute. And again, I just want to say thank you to everyone who came to the pre-party or the party this weekend or both or just were hanging out with us on social media i think it was really fun and i hope that you guys enjoyed um and i hope you enjoyed this plan with me and leave any questions down below and i will answer them otherwise i'll talk to you guys in my night i just realized that i do not love this <sighs> hold on no i think i'm gonna leave it i wish i would have put this one up top because that's a lot of half boxes or anyways I'm sorry. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.